Hey there, Mark Shelton with ProHanger Supply. ProHanger Supply is the North, Central, and South American distributor for Tapa Fix pasting machines and material dispensers. Uh, do quite a bit of videos on our pasting machine line of products, but today I'm going to show you one of our material dispensers that and, and how it can be used. Um, do a little demonstration on we're hanging some material today that we're using it on, so it's a good opportunity to show how we use it and you know different opportunities that it comes in handy. So today we are installing some Peter Fasano uh, printed grass. And so we've already trimmed it, uh, table trimmed it yesterday, but it comes on a, a 50 yard roll, which is not very easy to, uh, to position on a pasting machine. And plus I just don't want to be putting that large of a roll in a bind, especially with material this expensive. So we're going to pre-cut panels uh, and then feed the panels into our pasting machine after they're pre-cut. So we've got a 23 inch vertical repeat straight across match and we need pieces 102 inches for our walls. Um, so with this machine, I can put this master roll with this dispenser. I can put the master roll onto the dispenser. We have our inch counter here uh, that is designed to, this is the MZATI, M-Z-A-T-I, which is designed specifically for the whole line of dispensers. This works with the, uh, the 80, the 109, and the 140 dispenser. Um, and it attaches to this little bar right here where you also have your strip cutter uh, that can be used to cut off selvage. Now we take and trim this with a with a straight edge because you know this this is more for taking selvage off. It's not going to give you a um, a seamable finish, uh, but it is good. Like when you're running, you know, pulling digitals through a dispenser uh, and just need to get your selvage off. You're still going to do a double cut on the wall, but you need to take your selvage off uh, as you're pulling panels through your dispenser. You can use your strip cutters to take your selvage off, but we we hand trim this. Um, but so I've already got this loaded on and so we're going to go ahead. We've got our ceiling line. We know where we want to cut this. Uh, I need, like I said, panels that are 102 inches long. Pattern repeats 23 inches. So we're, we're going to just go ahead and pull them around. It's a little, actually a little less than 23 inches, like 22 and three quarters. So it winds up our pattern repeat, uh, repeats at 113 is our next time that it repeats. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. Uh, show you how it works. There's also a stand that comes with this, just didn't have it in the trailer, so you can also you know, just put it on your table. Uh, there also is a handy hook back here, if you can come around here. Uh, this hooks on to a ladder rung, so you can actually, you know, you have a little thumb screw here, a little bracket that will grab onto a ladder rung. You can put your dispenser on there and, and push the, position it that way. I like the little stand that comes with it because it has a shelf. It's mobile, of course, and so you can move it around but it also has a shelf that you can roll your material up on uh, as you're pulling it through. But we're just gonna do it on our table today because that's what we had in the truck. So again, I've already got my where I, where I wanna cut it. Uh, our ceiling line is gonna be two inches below here. We've got our pattern marks. We're gonna go ahead and zero that counter out. Now you notice I've got some little stop cones here that work with a set screw. Uh, Dispenser comes with two of them, so I, I, I've got this roll positioned on both sides with those little stop cones pushing it in so it's not traveling on my dispenser. This is also called the uh, GAU109I because it is marked in inches. If I wanted to take a certain amount off either, either side, I can set my stop cones uh, and put this roll here and, and see my inches and so I can set my strip cutter to cut off certain widths. So also, if, you know, if I'm pulling material through and I need to get to a corner, I need to cut to a corner, I can, you know, put my strip cutter on there at a certain width using my inch, my inch markings on my dispenser and cut it to, you know, to specific widths. Not doing that right now. We're just cutting panels to be able to transfer to our machine and pull them through one at a time. So I'm just going to go ahead and pull to 113. That'll give me a little bit of extra to feed into my machine and be able to just cut off because it takes about four inches to be able to get to your paste when you're feeding a new panel into your machine. So got a little cutting edge here. And there you go, we've got our panels ready to feed into our machine, quick and easy. Uh, just one more use for this dispenser uh, that uh, can come in handy, make your job quicker, make your job easier. Uh, www.prohangersupply. Thank you for your time. Give us a call. Uh, check us out.